Hi, I'm Father Eric Sundrup, and I'm joined by Father Patrick Gilger from America Media, and you are watching Jesuit Autocomplete. Do Jesuit. That's a long one. Yeah. I'm, I'm worried about that one. <laughs> So we've got our handy card here. What's our card today? Our card is Do Jesuits. Ooh, uh, okay. <laughs> Things that make me nervous. Do Jesuits in a Google search. All right. The first question from the internet is, do Jesuits get paid? Yes, they do, but they don't get to see their paychecks. Yeah, so Jesuits do get paid, but we actually don't receive personally the money we get. So for example, I'm earning a salary from a handful of places at the moment, which will remain private. <laughs> okay. And that money does not go to me, actually. It goes to my community. And my community takes care of that. And then I get like a, a salary, or not really like stipend. a stipend. Thank you. A stipend out of uh, whatever money I've earned, just whatever I would need. And I make a budget with my superior, and they give me the I go to the superior and, and say, yeah. can I have part of my allowance? Or Pretty I spent much. too much on candy. Can I get something else? Look, it's very real. Yeah, it also varies the, you know, where you are. So you're going to adjust to the cost of living for where you are. So yeah. right now, I'm um, filming in New York City. Yeah. Um, my stipend is a little higher than when I, <laughs> when I was living in the outskirts of Peru. So, do Jesuits still exist? <laughs> Who wrote that? I, I hope so, man. I don't know. Yes, can we're right we, here. Can we get some like special effects stuff, or we just poof out of existence after that question? Yes, yes, I'm right here. Do Jesuits believe in Jesus? Yes, it's in the name, the Society of Jesus. So, of course, we believe in Jesus. Yeah, maybe in a little bit of a moment of pious seriousness will not surprise you that I'm going to be this way. I'm going to just stand here. You can go ahead. <laughs> Jesus is my best friend. So he's the guy I want to spend the most time with, not just some intellectual, ex intellectual assent to believing in Jesus. Uh, this is my closest friend. Yeah, the spiritual exercises of St. Ignatius, which is kind of how the spirituality of the Society of Jesus is based, where it comes from, um, is it's very important to imagine yourself next to and praying alongside the scenes from Jesus' life. So Jesuits specifically spend a lot of time imagining what it would be like to accompany Jesus. So mm -hmm. clearly belief in Jesus. Mm -hmm. Do Jesuits pray the divine office? Depends on whether they're ordained or not. Yeah, um, we do pray the divine office if we are priests or when we are ordained to uh, orders in the Catholic Church, we're asked to. Now, what might be interesting, though, is we don't pray the divine office together. And this was a big controversy when St. Ignatius, our founder, was kind of establishing the rules by which we would live. Um, many people at the, in the church at that time were not happy when he asked to exempt Jesuits from praying the divine office together. And the reason he did it is because he wanted Jesuits to be focused on work first. We call it the apostolate, he, as yeah. apostles in the world. He didn't want them having to come home That's to right. the mother house every day and switch with the work they were doing. He wanted them to be able to stay where they were, keep mm -hmm. the work going. So that's, that's an important component of it. And so, yeah, we do pray the divine office. Do, Je oh, this is a long one. Do Jesuits, da, 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 da. Do, Jesu do Jesuits how? How do Jesuits? That's what. How do Jesuits differ from other priests? I was about to say they're cooler, but that's not always true, especially in my case. <laughs> um, well, this gets complicated because you have two basic divisions of, of priests. You've got diocesan priests, and then you've got priests that are members of religious orders, mm -hmm. right? So priests that are sort of in communities. So diocesan priests are primarily concerned with the work of parishes. So they're going to stay in a diocese or an archdiocese, so in a geographic region, yeah, in a and, place. In a place and work with the parishes. The big distinction there for the Jesuits is we get moved and missioned wherever the need is greatest. So, you know, I'm originally from Ohio. I'm currently in New York. I've worked in Peru. I've worked in California. I've worked in Michigan. I'll get moved around a lot depending on where they would need me at the time, and I'll just move into the new Jesuit community. That's really different from a lot of diocesan priests. I think of the whole Catholic Church kind of like a big umbrella with lots of tines that come out of it, you know, that support the thing. And Jesuits are just... tine. <laughs> You know, one of those metal things. <laughs> the rods, right? Okay. <laughs> yeah, exactly, whatever. It's, the Jesuits are one of those things that come out of there. Now, there are lots of different ones. Franciscans and Benedictines and Dominicans and many of the women's religious orders, uh, Carthusians, all of these different kinds of things. Now, what characterize those different orders are the different spiritualities that we have. And so Jesuits are distinct by our spirituality. We are supposed to be focused on obedience, education, missionary work out in the world. There are different focuses that we would have. We take on one of those. Do Jesuits 
or how do Jesuits dress? One leg at a time. Oh, God. <laughs> Said that out loud. <laughs> Essentially, we are asked to dress as respectable priests of whatever area we happen to be serving in uh, would wear. So respectable priests here near the studio in New York would dress like this. Thus, yeah. I'm dressed like that, probably touching the mic and upsetting the editors. Um, but that that is different in different places that I've worked, and so you would adjust um, for what is whatever is necessary. You know, whatever you need to wear. Like if I'm working in the garden or garden, or if I'm you know uh, going for a run, I dress appropriately for for that task. But these are these are good questions. Do Jesuits get paid? Yes, but not to them, to the community. Do they still exist? For God's sake, we're still here. Uh, do they believe in Jesus? Of course. Do they pray the divine office if they are ordained? Yes. How do Jesuits differ from other priests? Lots of different ways. We went over those. And how do Jesuits dress? However, a respectable clergy of the area would dress. Thank you for your questions to Google or to us. This is Eric Sundrup, and my name is Father Patty Gilger. We're doing our best to answer some questions about the Catholic faith here at America Media. If you'd like to learn anything more about the Jesuits, Catholic faith, our spirituality, you are welcome to subscribe to our YouTube channel, and we'll see you next time on Jesuit Autocomplete. Very good. Yeah, we God did it. <laughs>